Now let us look at this problem. Which of the following is correct with respect to the bond issuance cost? The bond issuance costs are the administrative fees or the other kind of or the other kind of expenses that are that are associated with the issuance of a bond. So US GAAP and IFRS treat the bond issuance cost differently. Under US GAAP, it is a part of the part of the carrying value of the bond. Part of the carrying value of the bond. The balance sheet. Whereas under IFRS, the bond issuance cost is reduced from the carrying value of the bond, that is new carrying value is equal to original carrying value minus issuance cost. And this cost carrying value is reported in the balance sheet. So let us look at these options. Under US GAAP, the initial bond liability on the balance sheet is reduced by the amount of the bond issuance cost. This is incorrect because it is not reduced. It is a part of the carrying value. Under US GAAP, the bond issuance costs are capitalized on the asset. This option is correct because it is a part of the carrying value of the bond and it is amortized or capitalized on the asset. Under IFRS, the bond issuance costs are treated as an amortized discount. They are not treated as an amortized discount, but they are the, rather they are netted out against the carrying value of the bond. So my option B is the correct option.